England looking for a fast start to get things done early here. Yeah, and it's obvious, Peter, you don't want to be playing catch-up after the opening group game. So we can expect this to be highly competitive. Three points here and the feel-good factor of eventual progression kicks in. It's a, a great foundation to tackle the rest of the, uh, the group games. So that's got things on the way. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Harry Kane. Kane! Marvellous goal! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. So, a breakthrough already. Lamar. Henderson did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Saka drives it forward. Away from it. Hits one! He's pulled off a fine save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Rabio, Mbappe. And he's searching through. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Nkunku. France have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Shoots! That has certainly tested the keeper. Kane is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Areola gets it upfield. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Grealish. And here's Kane. Over to the left. Has a hit! And in again. They've scored! Two up and threatening to pull clear. Areola did well the first time, nothing he could do about the follow-up. Oh, that's great awareness, full marks to him as he was just that bit quicker than everyone else on the follow-up. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. England grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Jordan Henderson. Grealish. Loose ball, who's going to get that? Rabio. France have it back and they can go again. Dinks one in. Benzema. Yeah, it's been intercepted and that will come to nothing. Sure. And he has been fouled there.
And it's Shaw. He's had that put on the plate. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Nkunku. And here's Benzema. Stones battles to win it back. Kane. Well weighted. Going through. Grealish! Oh, that's brilliant! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy! And the lead is extended still further. Well, the goalkeeper would have helped to make his mind up on how he was going to finish it. England take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. And it's Grealish. Oh, good interception. And it's played forward. Walker demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. England are in control here on the brink of half-time. Nkunku. Shaw did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. He's got through. Going for goal! Oh, outstanding save. England just served up a reminder of how good they can be on the break. Their method is clear. Kunku had a shot, and he should have made it four. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Now it's Grealish. Cut out in the nick of time. That's gone a long way up and away. Lamar. And the half-time whistle goes, as easy as one, two, three. It really has been that straightforward halfway through the match, but very little to suggest that much will change over the second half. This looks well and truly sewn up already, Peter, but please feel free to forget what I've just said if there's a spectacular turnaround. England have established themselves in a position of absolute supremacy. Grealish! It's off target and by quite a way. England are looking quite mean on the counter and combating that requires even more meanness. Place it over to the other flank. Keeper's got good distance on that. Saka. Has he picked him out? Oh, shooting chance! And with the goal at his mercy, a dreadful miss. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Benzema needed to come up with a better ball. Ah, oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Mbappe. And he certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Well, sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different spell of play and uh, it makes even less sense. 
Saka. Gets it back. Now it's Grealish. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, and they've got to be careful, Peter, that they don't allow their attempt to snuff out the threat now to turn into indiscipline. Rabiot. Rabiot. They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing department. Whistle's gone, that's uh, foul. Mbappe. And once more they can't get through. Walker goes looking. Saka, and it's Grealish, chance! Forward it goes. Stones plays it forward. Well positioned to make that interception. It's a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Goes long. Jordan Henderson. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. That's a decent ball. Abraham! Outstanding save to keep that out. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Henderson. Kunku, Rabio, Nkunku, Rafael Varan finds him. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Wrestled off the ball. And it's Griezmann. And here's Benzema. And now they can launch a counter. Saka. Out to the right. Too long, and over the line. Pavar tries to switch the play. He's got away.
Keeper sends it forward. Mbappe. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Right through the middle. What a piece. Had a shot. Yes! Surely now they are well and truly out of sight. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. It's become a case of men against boys. And the referee brings it to a close. England have got off to an ideal start. Three points on day one, and it bodes well for the campaign ahead. How do you look back on the game then, Jim?